Alright, what is going on everyone? The Blitz one for one here, back at it again for another video. Sorry guys, I had to make this video um, come out really late. Um, a bit late on this video, but really sorry about it, but here we are making it. Alright, so this is a tips and tricks video for Ace Combat 7 for you beginners. So, uh, the first thing I notice when people go into matches, they'll go search for room, and then total cost make sure you um you go to if you're going to play online you go to total cost and put it to um then put it to unlimited or any because you're going to come across high t jets and like they're just going to murk you. you're going to come across f-22 su-57 and you're like only in the f-15 for example when you're big getting off so just keep that in mind as well so yeah And also, as well, before I recommend, um, before you go play multiplayer, I highly recommend you finish the campaign first. Just go through the campaign, and trust me, you'll find it a lot easier. So to do basic maneuvers, you have to slow down to your speed to um, 150 or below. Uh, not 150, you have to slow it down to 450 or below. This maneuver in multiplayer is not really... You don't really want to do this too much because then you're going to slow down too much then missiles are going to hit you. But you can do it though. So what you want to do is slow down below 150, uh, 450 sorry. And then hold L2 and R2 at the same time. And then bring your f um, your left thumbstick down at, at the same time. So that's like sort of like a Cobra maneuver. So I'll do it again for you. So below 450. Uh, uh, you can do a bit more perfectly um, without it stalling, but you got to hit that uh, that gas straight as well. So as soon as you flip, you want to um, you want to let go of the L2 straight away and just keep holding on the on the gas. Alright, so I'll do the maneuver again. So, I wish we could do these moves at higher top speeds because in real life you can. I don't know why they didn't do that for the game, but. And also, um, when you hear the missile missile in multiplayer, which is it's very annoying, especially in campaign, um, make sure you look at your mini map on the bottom left because you can see the missiles like a little white tiny uh, line on the minimap and then you can see that going past you if it's really gonna hit you or not and so you don't have to keep dodging and rolling around all the time when you hear missile so so yeah and also we're gonna get into um, the perks now uh, what I use for multiplayer So for multiplayer, I use the Sukhoi 57 a lot. I really like this jet. Uh, so the parts I use for it, um, not perks, sorry. So I use light uh, blisk, obviously, to keep that mobility up. And I put... Uh, Greatly increases stead missile power, directional proximity. Y you definitely want to get um, these perks that I have on right now for your missiles. Increases uh, missile flight distance, missile, uh, missile lock on range. You definitely want to get these um, perks for your missiles because those are what you're mainly shooting your enemies with. And you definitely want to get this perk as well. It increases the standard missiles homing capabilities and speed. And standard missiles lock on distance and flight distance is increased. So now um, you can use whatever jet you're comfortable with. 
Um, but me, I really like using the Sukhoi 57. And uh, I really love the 52 as well, the F-52, uh, the American fighter jet. Uh, it's really good, but I don't know. There's something I like a bit more about the Sukhoi. change that to I don't I'm not really entirely sure because I did try to use a missile like this in multiplayer and it wouldn't let me um, it, I just wouldn't have a special uh, rocket in my inventory if I used this in multiplayer and some um, very good jets I'll give you some tips of um, so, the Su-30 uh, SM, that is a really, uh, I haven't tried this one out yet, uh, this is quite alright too, the Su-35S, but the Su-30 uh, SM is really good. Uh, this jet, I tried it out, I don't know, I just do way better with the 52 or the Su-57, it, I don't know, there's something about this jet, it just doesn't really feel right to me, it doesn't even really feel... It just doesn't, like, I don't know, just doesn't, because this game, I really like using modern modern day jets that are out today, so yeah. And also, I reached 1,200 views on my Astro um, C40 TR controller video, my thoughts and um, impressions on it. Um, it got mixed uh, likes and dislikes, so that that's good to see, but I'm getting views though, which is really good. And thank you for your new subscribers, thank you for 53 subscribers, that is quite a lot uh, for my YouTube channel. Really do appreciate it. Um, and I'll be doing an Astro A40 TRX edition um, headset video. But in order to make that video happen, you guys have to make it happen. You guys have to comment below Astro A40 TRX edition headset. So you guys have to make it happen or just put in comments, um, do the video on the Astro A40 headset and I will do it and as well drop a like as well and really do appreciate the 53 subscribers. Uh, thank you guys for that. And hopefully we can one day make it to a thousand. That would be that would be awesome. And uh, I'm just looking at your comments now. Some of your comments. Uh, I do really appreciate uh, some of you guys supporting me. Uh, uh, Zoo Uma, damn, you deserve more views. Yeah, I replied, thanks, man. And yeah, I. If you guys are wondering the sound, oh no, I won't get into that, I'll save it for the headset video. <laughs> uh, sorry if I sound a bit, I don't know, wheezy because my nose is blocked a bit. Uh, it's that time, freaking, I hate when my nose gets blocked. But yeah, anyways, if you guys want to make that video happen of the Astro A40 TR X Edition headset, um, please comment below and drop a like as well um so yeah uh if this video was helpful to you guys um if there's some things i missed out in this video for the tips and tricks on ace combat 7 uh because i haven't played this game in like uh probably about two weeks now because i've been just playing uh and then for honor as well i've been playing that game i, I don't know I, there's something about for honor that makes me come back once in a while and also Resident Evil 2, be playing that. If you guys want me to make a video on Resident Evil 2, drop um, drop a comment below. And yeah, uh, hopefully this video can get like at least 50 views or something like that. That would be really nice. Um, and also, yeah, thank you guys for the 53 subs. Really do appreciate it. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you in the next video. If you guys want that video to happen about the Astro A40 headset, please comment below. And I'll see you in the next one.